Hi there. I'm Maggie, and this is a very fast Tuesday tip. I don't know if you folks know about Free Sculpt. So what we're going to do is I am in the Premiere Plus 2 Embroidery module, and I am going to Frames, a closed frame, and I rather like one of the little hearts here from Candle Wicking. Margin 2.5 doesn't really apply. I am going to make this a bit smaller. And the center. Now I'll go to lettering. And for a font, I want a size of about 40. And I know I want to scribe. So I could have done name, but I wanted to show you that you can search on size. Here's scribe. I'm going to set it to 40. Now the very important part of this is shape. And when you apply your word, it will go into the various shapes we have here for choices. But you'll notice we don't have a heart. What you do have, this second row, on the far right, it says Free Sculpt. And when you use Free Sculpt, you get a lot more points on the word you apply than you do with the other shapes. So I'll show you that. We'll do Free Sculpt. For this, I am going to use all caps because if you are trying to fit your letters into a shape and you use upper and lower case, the small letters will always have a space above them. Hit apply, and you'll see all the green points here. Now the other neat thing about this is it does come in with center points, so you can move those. And what we're going to do is just move these to match the shape. And do do do. While you're moving these, let's see here. Oop. You, nope, I want this. Now you do have to put the shape first to get all the difference. And you'll see I skipped this one because it wants to just rotate. The other ones are the ones that match. And if you don't like how the letters come in, if you slide these, you'll find you can make them more slanted in one direction or another. Bring this up. We really do want it off the candle wicks, but I'm mainly doing this to show you what you can have here. Maybe we want this closer to the corner. So there you go. Although there are shapes when you select letters and words, you can use any shape you want to fit a word in when you choose the shape Free Sculpt.